Hi, Marty. Today we're going to learn about the rainbow lorikeet. What's that? It's a bird. Let's go outside and see them for ourselves. Okay, Mama. I'm outside now. Where is the lorikeet? Oh, Marty. You need to look up. The rainbow lorikeet is an Australian bird from the parrot family. This is one bird which truly suits its name. The back green feathers hide a body of blues, reds, yellows and, yellows and oranges. Its screech can be heard before the bird can be seen as they sing to each other across the trees. Lorikeets are incredibly loud and incredibly fast, shooting through the air in twos or more from tree to flowering tree. Their diet mainly consists of nectar, blossoms, pollen and seeds, which they pull out of flowering eucalypts like these ones. The end of the lorikeet's tongue is like a hairy brush, which soaks up the liquid nectar from deep inside the flowers. Look, Mama, I'm looking for pollen just like the rainbow lorikeet. I'm looking for seeds, I'm looking for, for blossoms, which are using my nose and pushing them into the ground, just like the lorikeet. Good job, Marty. They make their nests in the hollows of trees and lay two white eggs, which take one month to hatch. Until the chick is old enough to fly itself, its mum and dad feed it nectar and pollen. The rainbow lorikeet is about 30 centimetres long. And it's hard to tell the difference between the males and females because they have the same colourings. But if you look closely, you might notice the ones with a smaller head. They're the females. Rainbow lorikeets can be found all over Australia, although it was humans who introduced them to Perth and Tasmania. We don't quite know if someone deliberately let them free in these states or if they escaped from being pets, but them coming into those states caused problems for other birds and wildlife that lived there. You see, the lorikeet is pretty bossy and has even been seen pulling baby possums out of tree hollows to use their nest for themselves. They also love fruit like cherries, apples, pears and grapes which cause big problems for farmers trying to grow their crops to sell. But despite all their cheeky behaviours, there's no doubt that the lorikeet is a beautiful bird to see and hear. Now Marty, I told you that the lorikeet flies really fast, right? Well today we're going to make our own flying lorikeet. It's time to print out the template and collect your things ready to start. You will need a double sided printout and these colours. Follow along with the step by step tutorial and pause at any time you need. Have fun! Mistake, Mama? Yes, Marty. But it's okay. Mistakes are how we learn.
Now it's time to test out your plane. Okay, I am ready to chase that lorikeet. Uh, uh, I mean plane. Ready, go! <laughs> again! Again! Thank you for coming and learning about lorikeets with me today, everybody. I'll see you next time. Bye. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to send us your vid photos or videos of your flying lorikeet planes to feature in our viewer projects videos. See you next time. Bye. Bye, everyone.